Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be trying out the Circle Water Bottle, which promises that you can change the intensity and the flavor of your water by turning a dial and just by changing the pot. They have like 74 different flavors, but today I just got the starter kit, which includes a bottle and two pods. I picked this up at Walmart for about $19.98, and I thought it was a great deal, so I figured I'd give it a review. It says it includes one 22 ounce bottle with a comfort grit lid and two flavor cartridges. So we'll try that out. It says that each circle cartridge can flavor the equivalent of 20 ounce, oh, of six 20 ounce fully flavored bottles of water, which doesn't actually seem that bad. It's got zero calories on everything which is awesome and it seems like each pod has different vitamins and stuff like that and some of the pods even have caffeine in them so without further ado let's pop this open and we'll check this out So here's our bottle, and it comes with two flavors, mixed berry and fruit punch. Set that to the side, and I think we're going to try the active, and it says it's fit sip. So I'm thinking that means it's got either vitamins in it or caffeine. I don't know but we're just gonna try it out so we're gonna take our unbranded water we're just gonna pour it right into our bottle all right and then we're just gonna take our pod out of the package Pods look not too bad. Mine has like some plastic on it, which is great. Is that is that plastic or is that flavoring? I don't know, it's like disintegrating. Anyways, we're just gonna give it a try. So it's just as simple as taking out of the package screwing it down onto your bottle. I guess you got to screw the lid on. And then you just rotate this dial on flavor. So we're just going to max it out. Max it all the way out because why not? Ooh. That is way too strong. We're going down to 4. I was on five, so let's actually try four this time. You know what? There's like something wrong with the suction or something. I'm getting like just straight up juice. Oh God, what the hell? God damn, I don't know what the hell is going on. It's like it needs some kind of air hole or something. Oh yeah, no, it definitely needs airflow in there. I don't know, don't screw the lid down all the way, I guess. I don't, I don't know. 
I don't know how else to get. I don't know how else to get over that. But at a four, the mixed berry isn't actually that bad. There was a, a couple of uh, couple of instances where I got like straight up just like pure syrup out of this thing, and that was super sour and did not taste good at all. But on the number four, with it seeming like it's working okay, it seems to be pretty tasty. So with that being said, I'm gonna turn it down to X again and make it just pure water. And it definitely made it just pure water again. So that's actually very cool, I like that. It says to use it within 10 days of opening. Uh, and I don't know how you're gonna keep them like safe if you're gonna change it out. But I'm assuming they're not expecting you to take it out and try a different flavor for a little bit. So, with all that being said, I gotta give Mixed Berry probably about a 5.5. .5. I mean, it for Mixed Berry, it's not bad, but I'm just not a big fan of Mixed Berry at all. Not even the slightest. Alright, now we're gonna try Fruit Punch out. So again, it is just as simple. Oh, see, so this one doesn't have this one doesn't have any of that powdery stuff all over it. So, just like that, you're gonna screw it right onto the bottle. Pop your little top. Oh, I think I just broke it. The whole top came off. Oh well. Um, we're gonna turn this to four. Gonna see how this tastes. Okay, four is a little weak for the fruit punch. Okay, maybe not. Never mind. It's kind of like I'm getting nothing but syrup again. It's like I'm getting nothing but syrup. What the hell? Am I not supposed to screw it down all the way? Am I supposed to leave some air somewhere? Anyways, fruit punch is actually really good. Let's see here. There's literally no directions. <laughs> There's literally no directions, so nobody can say that I'm an idiot and I'm just doing it wrong. Because it doesn't tell you how to do it right in the first place. It just says turn the dial and it works. It says fill, fasten, dial, and drink. Well, let's drink a little bit more. Maybe I was just doing it wrong. It's like there's like a suction issue of like like there's no air getting in the bottle you can like hear you can like hear it I mean I would maybe say don't tighten it down that tight but Anyways, with that being said, 
I probably got to give the fruit punch flavor a solid 7.1. It tastes pretty good when it comes out in the right amounts because so far the issue that I've been having is it feels like there's just straight syrup coming out and like the first couple of sips that I get is just nothing but like pure concentrated fruit punch and that nasty mixed berry flavor but I think you gotta just maybe drink a little more and not screw the thing down the screw the lid down so tight and it might be way better but I like it with that being said I hope you guys enjoyed today's video Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.